Let's hear now from Dr. Michael Greger. Dr. Michael Greger, the physician, best-selling author, and speaker. You're a graduate of Cornell University and the Tufts University School of Medicine. My name is Dr. Michael Greger, uh, founder of the nonprofit website nutritionfacts.org. Every year I read through every issue of every English language nutrition journal in the world. My mission in life is to help make people make evidence-based, science-based decisions as to what to feed themselves and their families to prevent, treat, even reverse chronic diseases. Does it make sense to do milk is for babies? Why would anyone drink milk after weaning and then drink milk of another species? Just doesn't make any sense. You know, for the last two million years of kind of human evolution, you know, what are bodies kind of more adapted to eat? And so they make some uh, some excellent points, like dairy, for example, is a relatively new invention, really not natural, right? The fact that I mean, milk is for babies, right? Kind of, I mean, uh, you know, I mean, so we're the only species that drinks milk past weaning. It's kind of weird, and then to drink milk of another species, it's just kind of, you know, so they so they kind of present that as it just doesn't really make sense that our bodies really weren't kind of made to have that kind of you know hormone load, etc., later in life.